Welcome everyone to the first episode of Red Dead Redemption 2 Story Mode. So it's been a long time coming. I've said for a while that I would start one and today is the day. So it's the first playthrough on the PlayStation 5. So we'll see how it goes. Do all the story mission, all the side mission that we can take our time to complete it. And we say we go for the free roam stuff or we organize it. It might be like a side of videos that are more edited just to show some stuff. So we'll see how we go about it. But I'm excited to start it. So let's go. By 1899, the age of outlaws and gunslingers was at an end. I'm so excited. America was becoming a land of laws. So chapter one is more like a big cinematic introduction. Even the West had mostly been tamed. So there's a lot of dialogue and background stories and learning about the characters. So it's not as eventful, so we'll go through it. We'll push through it, but a bit fun will start in chapter two. A few guns still roam but they were being hunted down and destroyed. Rockstar Games. So yeah, the chapter one is more like a tutorial. So there's gonna be a lot of like listening to the dialogue. I want to take out anything of the story so we can enjoy it as much as we can. Yeah, so that will be chapter one, and we'll have more freedom in chapter two to do whatever we want. So that's when we decide where we go, what mission we're gonna do, and how we're gonna work it. Enjoy, everyone. I don't remember much of it. Normally, I have a save in chapter two. Abigail says he's dying, Dutch. We'll have to stop someplace. Okay, Arthur's out looking. I sent him up ahead. Uh. If we don't stop soon, we'll all be dying. This weather, it's May. I'm just hoping the law got as lost as we did. There. Oh. Arthur! Any luck? Here we are. I found a place where we can get some shelter. Let Davy rest while he... You know, an old man in town, abandoned. It ain't far. Come on. Come on! Yeah! Go to Porta. Here we go, chapter one. So it's a really Western cinematic chapter, so it's a bit slow to put everything in context, but that's what puts me in the mood. Bring him in here! Still remember the first time I played. Wondering what's going on, what are all those characters, who they are, what they're gonna do. What's the story? Miss Gaskell, get that fire lit quick. Miss Jones, bring in whatever blankets we have. Mr. Pearson, see what we've got in terms of food. Davy's dead. There was nothing more you could have done. What are we gonna do? We need supplies. Well, first of all, you're gonna stay here, and you were gonna get yourself warm. Now, I sent John and Mike scouting out ahead. Arthur and I, we're gonna ride out, see if we can find one of them. And this, just for a short bit. And I don't see what other choice we have. Listen. Listen to me, all of you, for a moment. Now, we've had, well, a bad couple of days. I loved Davy. Jenny, 
Sean, Mac, they might be okay. We don't know. We don't know. But we lost some folks. Now, if I could throw myself in the ground, in their stead, I'd do it. Gladly. But we are going to ride out, and we are going to find some food. Everybody, we're safe now. There ain't nobody following us through a storm like this one. And by the time they get here, well, we're going to be, we're going to be long gone. We've been through worse than this before. Mr. Pierce, Miss Grimshaw, I need you to turn this place into a camp. We may be here for a few days. Now, all of you, all of you, get yourselves warm. Stay strong. Stay with me. We ain't done yet. Come on, Arthur. All right. Let's go back in the car. Got some work to do. We ain't run into them yet, so they both must have headed down the hill. Sure. Hey, I ain't had time to ask. What really went down back there on that boat? We missed you. That's what happened. Come on. Flashy reflection. Oh. Hey, you need horses? Oh, yeah. Hey, Mr. Smith, get yourself indoors. You need to rest that hand. I'll live. Get indoors, son. I... We need you strong. Okay. Hold it. It's too much to speed. Come on, let's go. Ain't sure what we're gonna find out here, Dutch. We have to try. Stay close. We'll do our best to stick to the trail. This goddamn weather. Been two days or more like this now. Oh, it has to blow over soon. That it's too wide, fast. Yeah, so it's a lot of like tutorial inputs in that chapter, so be ready. Right. Bridge coming up. Take it easy. Taking it easy. Can we talk to Dutch? Not yet. Can't believe we lost Davy too. He's the last one, Arthur. No more. We need to get those people warm and fed. At least we don't need to worry about Pinkerton's tailing us in this. Uh, a couple more days, we'll be on the other side. You need to help me pick the others back up. You're the only one I can rely on to stay strong right now. We got fire and shelter. That's a start. We need food, though. And what about the money? Please tell me you at least got the money before it all went to hell on that boat. We did. It stashed with the rest of the money in town. Hey, I think I see something up the path. What do you see, Dutch? You up ahead. Who's there? Whoa. Micah. Oh, Micah. Gentlemen. Found anything? I think so. Found a little homestead down that way. Okay. Anyone home? Sure. Place is blazing with light and noise. Sounded like a party. Let's go see. Follow me. <clears throat> How's Davy doing? Well, he didn't make it. Nor did little Jenny. That's too bad. Davy was a real fighter. Both of them calendar boys is, or <laughs> was. Yeah. And Mac, Sean, we don't know. Quite a business. I'm glad you're all right, Micah. Always. Ask him if he's seen John. Hey, have you seen John, Micah? Didn't see much of anything once this storm came in. He yeah, hasn't true. seen him. He'll be fine. Things always turn out right for that boy. I hope. 
Is that what you want? Are still out there somewhere too. Hey, Arthur, let me take the rear. You move up. All right. Okay, go. Talk to Micah. Are you sure about this? You sure about this, Micah? Mr. Morgan. I never thought I would be so pleased to see your face. Been really? kind of lonely out here. Where's everyone else? Old mining camp back up the hill. Huddled around a fire waiting for daddy to put food on the table. Said it before. We got too many mouths to feed. Well, we got a few less now, so you should be happy. That ain't fair, Arthur. I earn my share. You think it's unreasonable to expect others to do the same? So, this house... You speak to the people there already? No. Like Dutch told us. Look, but don't talk to no one. Just following orders. You know me. I'm a good boy. Right. That's what I would say. How much further? Not far. What does that mean? Not far. Mm, thanks. Okay. I never liked my car from the start. So. It's right to the bone. He has a crappy attitude. Okay, let's keep it down now, gentlemen. It's just up ahead. Snuff and stash those lanterns, boys. Best you two lie low on this. Easy. Okay, let's head down there. Elf it is paid in the lower left corner. Oh yeah, we don't have much to start with, that's for sure. Gotta be careful with that. I think we can get more health. Uh, let's hitch up I don't here. remember how. Easy. All right, boy. Or girl, I don't remember. Let me handle this. Girl. We don't want to spook these fine people. Sounds like quite the party. Yeah, sounds like they're having fun. You two, get yourself out of sight. One lonely man is a lot less intimidating than three nasty-looking degenerates. Oh, Micah, are we nice to look at now? Arthur, you take that old shed on the left and stay low, both of you. Press R1 to get cover. Yes, yeah, so I need to get used to the to the control again. Hello. Shut up, Billy. Excuse Here me. Here we go. Hello. Oh, well, hello, friend. What you want? I am very sorry to disturb you. Uh, my friends and I, well, we got into some trouble up the way, lost in the oh, storm. There's a guy coming from the back. Ah, uh, gentlemen. We can't help you, mister. I got He's my cops. Arthur. Dying on the Arthur, we got a problem. Oh. <laughs> Folks, there's a corpse right here. Now, I, I just Arthur. need... Some There's a body food. in the wagon. Oh, I hear you. Just Gentlemen. keep your eyes on Dutch. Please. I think you should go Old now, Elwant buddy. Should have been well. Trusty Chatterman revolver. Now. One more shot. One more dead. One more dead. One more dead. Go. 
Got him. Arthur, I said I'd handle this. Didn't seem to be going too well. Goddamn, O'Driscoll boy's here. Why? I don't know. Maybe same reason as us. Micah, go bring the horses closer to the house. Arthur, let's go search the cabin. Well, that's a bloody bloodbath. Smells like a party in here. Turn the place upside yeah. down. Grab as many supplies as you can. We need the essentials. Food, medicine, whiskey. Let's search the cabinet. At that center of the game, we want to grab that everything uh, we can. I'm starving. You should eat something now. Get your strength up for the ride back. Alright, some food up in the satchel. Yeah, so that's why we see the health benefit or the stamina benefit for the health core and stamina core. Uh, bad beans. Bad beans, mate, are always the way to go. Small biscuits. Yeah. O'Driscoll. I don't believe it. It's a strange one, all right. Maybe they're hiding up here, too. There's a big price on Colm O'Driscoll's head. Nearly as big as the one on yours. Big old pool of blood on the floor here. I saw him. Probably the poor bastard who lived here. Micah found a dead body in the wagon outside. Wanting Colm dead is about the only thing me and Uncle Sam agree on. Uh, medicine. Good, good, good. That's gonna be useful. So we have a uh, place is dry and warm. Is it? We satchel, could maybe move so the women and Jack down here. Maybe. We'll see how they are when we get back. I don't really want us to split up. So yeah, we don't have much space in the satchel at the moment because we have not good it. Pack these on the horses. Grab anything you think we can use, then meet me out here. No worries. But then again, we need to get as much as we can right now, because in terms of food and anything, it's going to be hard to come by. Can we open the chest? Yes. What do we got? Oh, yeah, a bit of money now. That's good. Can we open the the jewelry. Oh yeah. Premium cigarettes and our first collecting card, cigarette card. Is there something over there? No. It's a new photograph. Hmm. Poor bastard was married to. Uh, poor guy. Jack and City. I don't know if there's anything else we can grab. Oh yeah, some classic old tape. Would be good for the holes. I think we went around. We haven't looked at the table, right? Let's have a quick look at the table. Oh yeah, some finishing. No salted meat. It's gonna be good for us. The rest is empty. Nothing shiny. Let's go back to the there, Ar just Arthur, taking our time. Keep looking for stuff. Arthur, go see if there's anything in that barn. Micah, you search the cabin. See what we All right, missed. Captain. Sure. Micah won't find anything. We'll grab everything. Hard to see the other two here at this dead bar. And we have a bit of money. 188. Better than nothing. We can't buy much with it, but hey. That door is sliding quite easily. Yeah, the first. You're gonna do what now? What's going on? Take that. Now this guy just jumped me. Oh, oh, oh did you he can take now? a punch though. Look at him. 
Sneaky little bastard. Should I kill him? No. Not yet. Find out what they're doing here and where Calm is. Oh, this son of a bitch will talk. Of course he will. Oh, hey. Where's Calm, O'Driscoll? With the others. At an old mining camp southwest of here. Near the lake. What are you bastards doing? Why are you up here? Uh, we're fixing to rob some train. Gonna blow the tracks. No, I don't know more than that, I swear. <laughs> mm, <know> it's more, <laughs> though. Well, I would say it looks like you have this, Arthur. Do what you want with him. I don't care. But bring that horse when you're done. Oh. I don't oh. know anything else. <laughs> we'll spare him. It's gonna die in the winter. Go. It's too cold outside. It's a wind. Let's drop a gun back. L1. Where's my hat? Thank you very much. I'm trying to jump me. Damn it, Driscoll. What a beauty of a horse. It's okay. You're all right, boy. You're all right, boy. Come with me. All saddled up and all ready to go. Continuing to bond with your horse increases. And I didn't have time to rest. Huh? So all the little bastards scurrying off. Yeah, figured he won't get far in this anyway. That looks like a decent horse. You should keep him. You need to hitch him. He's already skittish. Yeah. With all the commotion, I can understand it. It's there. Michael, what the hell do you think you're doing? Here oh, we go. Are you bastard? Ah! Oh, the guy I found in the cellar. Why up there, you? Leave her alone. I wasn't doing nothing. She's one of them O'Driscoll's. No, she ain't, Michael. Look at her. Miss, miss. Are you... Oh, you fool. Michael, look at her. Yes. Now, it is gonna be okay. We mean you no harm. Miss! Miss! Come on. It'll be okay. We need to get out of here and quick. Come Damn, on, my car. That's oh. what we're gonna have nice scene with. We need everything. You okay, miss? They came three days ago. Then both has been they. <laughs> Okay. Miss, you are safe now. And you can't stay here. You come with us. Of course. Miss, it's okay. We're bad men. We ain't them. It's okay. Bad men, yeah. Get on. We'll keep you safe until you figure out what you want to do. What's your name, miss? I'm sorry for your house. Miss. Adler. Adler. Sadie Adler. Mrs. I... He... He was my husband. What a waste. Thank you, Micah, once again. Ruining everything. Looks like it's Dutch. Hey, everybody, Dutch is back. How'd you get on? Uh, Micah found a homestead, but and we weren't gone. the first. Colm O'Driscoll and his scum, they beat us to it. Uh, uh, we found some of them there, but there is more about, apparently. Uh, scouting the train. Thank you. And that's the last thing we need right now, Dutch. Well, it is what it is, but we found... Some supplies, some blankets, a little bit of food. And this poor soul, Mrs. Adler, Miss Tilly, Miss Karen, would you warm her up? Give her a drink or something? And Mrs. Adler 
It's gonna be okay. You're safe now. They turned her into a widow. Animals. I need some rest. I haven't slept in three days. You're over here. Miss O'Shea will show you the way. Mr. Morgan, we put you in a room over here. Thank you, Miss Grimshaw. Mr. Bell, you're with the fellas over there. What? How come Arthur gets a room and I get a bunk bed next to Bill Williamson and a bunch of darkies? Get yourself to bed. Oh yeah, my case is a racist scrum too. If we needed more reason for getting, there's plenty more. Oh, think about that. Entered pursued by your memory. He ain't been seen in days. Weather ain't let up. He's strong. And he's smart. Strong, at least. Hello, Arthur. Abigail. Arthur, how you doing? Good. It's fine, Abigail. And you? What do you want? I need you to... I I'm sorry. I'm sorry to ask, but... It's little John. He's got himself caught into a scrape again. He ain't been seen in two... Two days. Your John will be fine. I mean... He may be as dumb as rocks and as dull as rusted iron, but that ain't changing because he got caught in some snowstorm. Please go take a look. Javier? Yes. Javier, will you ride out with Arthur <clears throat> to take a look for John? <clears throat> You're the two best fit men we've got. Now? She's... We're all... Yeah, we're pretty worried about him. I know. The situation were reversed and... Look for me. Ugh. Thank you. We can't catch her break. This way. Last I know, John was headed up the river. For all we know, he kept riding north and never looked back. He wouldn't leave. Not like that. Uh, wouldn't be the first time. It's just no, it's really bright. Yeah, it's really, really bright. I can't see much. Like, I can't see Arthur or, yeah. Not sure what's happening there. Hmm, I'll have to check it. Hey, I see some smoke. Come on, let's take a look. Because I don't remember any more of O'Driscoll's boys. That white. Well, Is this because of left. HDR on the PlayStation 5? Recently. So we can't even see Ravia. That way. Sure, well, come on then. There's some tracks leading to the river. Yep, yeah. It's quite bright. Let's cross. See, they continue up that way. Nearly. You think it's John? Not playable. You tell me. These are horse tracks for sure, but it could be anyone. Let's just wow. see where they lead. So the so, horse half is on the bottom too. You were there, Javier. I can't what see really what really happened on that boat. We had the money, it seemed fine. Then suddenly they were everywhere. Bounty hunters? No, Pinkertons. It was crazy. Raining bullets. What is happening? Seriously. Watch out for this crevice. Well, yeah, good that you tell me, because I can't see a girl team. in a bad way. But it was a bad situation. That ain't like him, though. I don't remember it being that bright. Tracks go left, down here. Davy got shot. Mac and John. Both shot too. Well, Sean, we don't even know. Not too sure why. I'm surprised we escaped at all. By the time you boys showed up from the other side of town, we were only just holding on. Bad business, all right. Damn snow's coming in hot again. We'll lose yeah. these tracks if we don't move fast. Well, I'm losing you right here, so I don't have no idea what I'm doing. Like, 
This is terrible. What is happening? I hope it's just like that because of the snow and it's about the from the that gel sitting from the PlayStation 5. And like Watch the game is not optimized for you. it. Because I really it's really bad. It wasn't that bad earlier. Was at night though. Horses are getting tired. Yeah, a lot of fresh snow here. I don't know about this, Javier. I mean, we can't follow nothing. Now let's push on a little bit. Maybe we'll pick up the trail again. It's a bit better now. Almost there. Boy. Come on now. Hopefully, it won't affect too much of the hey, rest look. of the mission Over or the there. play. You see that? For next episode, I checked the, the setting and made sure that like, all the fancy stuff is not on, John so was we got a better quality. Let's see if he can hear us. That's a dead horse, all right. I hear a drum. Come on, up there. Yeah, good boy. Let's go. Look at it's that. It's just plain white. I don't think you can go much further on the horses. You'll have to walk from here. All right. I grabbed that. that shotgun from your horse. Who knows what's up ahead? Do I have a shotgun now? Yes, I do. Oh, yeah, the south shotgun. Come on. Yeah, I'm clearly following you because we just walked in in white stuff. Can we touch her right here? Yeah. Are you sure about this? Over here! Yeah. It's coming from this way. Okay. It's slippery, be careful. Yeah, betcha. Yeah, that slippery. we're high up here. You're Call. telling me. Tell me. No visibility. Damn you, John. Careful. There's a drop here. Oh, yeah. I didn't even see it. Watch out here. Slippery again. Watch your head here. Crotch. Oh, it's L3 to crotch. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, from here. Watch your step. This is real slippery. Stay close to the wall. Up this here. time in that until your movement spin will be limited. Well, not if we eat some beans. Gap here. Climb that. That sounds closer now. Come on. We're coming, John. Uh, we go. That's quite the parkour session we're doing here. Damn, it's cold. I'm not sure we can go back that way at all. Anyway, I'm sure we can't. Let's keep moving then. Come on. Yeah, I'm following you. Don't you worry. Marston, you hear me? John, can you hear me? I feel it's like farther away than I remember. Oh, yeah. Down on the ledge. That's John. Oh, We're coming. Because normally I save in chapter two at the beginning of it, and then if I want to play a sub, I never replay in chapter here. one. It's pretty. All right. Right down, Marston. Look who it is. That's quite a scratch you got there. Never thought I'd say this, but it's good to see you, Arthur Morgan. <sighs> you 
You don't look so good. I don't feel too good neither. He looks really bad. <clears throat> Freezing. Don't die just yet, cowboy. Come on, compadre. Let's take you home. Well, we can't go back the way we came. Let's try this way. Ain't you a sorry sight? Can't argue with you there. See? I told Dutch you weren't the right man for this. I'm sure you did. <laughs> you alright? I don't think so. Come on. Hopefully it this will lead us out. Oh, here we go. White again. Oh, yeah. Perfect. Oh, I'll well. distract him while you get to the horse. I don't know if we can. Draw them off. If we're gonna be able to okay, like, here we go, John. kill them, that is if we don't see them. Oh, right, let's go to them. Yeah, yeah, I'm trying. Good work, Arthur. I can't see much with that. Okay, let's get going before any more of these bastards show up. Highlights. It's way too bright. At least we got them. Jesus. Yeah, we can't see anything. We definitely need to look at the graphic setting for next episode. So at least. Well, it won't be as bad, but we won't be on the snow, that's for sure, but... Come on, then. Let's get back to the others. I'm not sure what's the, what's happening. Who sent looking too bad early? I have uh, an hour, and I don't oh, feel can't see good. anything. You'll be fine. It's just like a, a dog bite. <sighs> New fella. Got bit by a dog. Died. An hour later. You ain't gonna die. Not yet. Oh boy. Yeah, it's bad. It's really, really bad. I know there's more wolves coming, and I'm just scared that I there. won't be able to see Aura. them at all. One. Two. Don't fall your horse. Shit, there's more on the right. We got more wolves on the left. Alejandro de mí. Get the hell out of here! Yeah. Okay, we're both dead. Yeah. You it's see good. any more up there? Don't think so. Jesus. You still with us, Marston? Just about. You're gonna be okay. We have some shelter now. Thanks for coming for me. Of course. You're welcome. That bullet in Blackwater, now this. You had a hell of a time. And Arthur always says, I'm lucky. You are All of lucky. us are lucky right now. Well, at least we ain't dead. So I say, we should ride in the water of... for a bit. Try to lose a scent. Don't want to leave a trail right back to camp. You know, we're going to need to come up with a better story for that scar. So, freezing, bleeding, starving. Damn near getting eaten to death ain't good enough for you. Nah, you, got a point, you can though. do better than that. One thing you ain't short on is fantasy. Here, let's cross to the left. Yeah, come on. Let's push hard and get back. See those buildings up ahead, John? That's where we camped. Nearly there. Can we get some help here? Yeah, you're all warm and cozy inside, but we're freezing. Come out and help us a bit. Can we get some help? We need some help here. Come on, help him down. You're alive. You're alive. All right, here we go. There we go. Oh, 
Hey, <laughs> careful, idiotas! It's his leg! Well, come on, let's get you warm. Face and everything. Thank you, thank you both. This is a new low, even by your standards. <laughs> thank you, Arthur. Thank you. You got any other lost maidens need saving? <laughs> Not today. Have you and Dutch talked about how we're gonna get out of this? I was just discussing with Herr Strauss when the weather breaks. I suppose we'll have to keep heading east. East? east. Into all that? That civilization? I know. The west is where our problems are worse. Come on, Herr Strauss. Let's get warm. Thank you, Mr. Moggy. <sighs> Chris Marston is alive. We have been running for weeks. We found shelter and been resting here in some old abandoned mining town while we wait the thaw. Hardly the spring I had been hoping for. Here we go. Oh, we got Spot gold. Now, Dutch. Let's have a look. Kill all the wolves without taking any damage. That's what we did. 80% accuracy. Yeah, so we didn't do too bad. Starting Get well. Warm. Starting well. We wait. So, we yeah, let's move. search all the dryers. But we're safe here. I don't think there's much. Warm enough. Oh, yes. Yeah, okay. I guess. You sound doubtful. Not doubtful, just worried. What do you think, Arthur? Well, I wasn't on that boat, so hard to say. But I trust your judgment, Dutch. Always have. Thank you, son. We have been shot at before, Jose. I don't feel that this is honestly anything new. True. I hope not. We had a bit of bad That's luck, right? but then the storm covered our tracks, so now we wait a bit, and we go back to Blackwater, and we get our money, and we get some more money, and we keep heading west. But we're heading east. You okay in here, Molly? It might be warmer by the fire. I'm fine, thank you. Okay. Molly O'Shea. We're safe. Stay strong, Jose. It's up to Dutch. What about you, Arthur? You doubt me too? Never. Good. Because you know me, son. I'm just getting started. Once we get some money, well, they... They better send some good men after us, because they ain't never gonna find us. But we need money. Of course, Dutch. Thank you, son. For your strength. It means a lot to me. And the money's Welcome. well hidden in Blackwater? I believe so, and they don't even know we dumped it. Oh, uh, well, you can wait there. Say hi to Hosea. We weren't there, Hosea. I'm aware of that. And they shouldn't have been either. Oh, we can't change nothing now. So now we have two missions on the map. One is with his son. The one is within now. So let's do the person one. I think it's the hunting one, right? So let's walk fast to get some. <coughs> We're gonna starve to death up here, Mr. Morgan. We're no, okay. Not. We have a few cans of food and a rabbit. For what? 10, 12 people? When I was in the Navy. I, I do not wish to hear about what you got up to in the Navy, Mr. Pearson. We were stranded at sea for 50 days. And you unfortunately survived. When we ran away from Blackwater, I wasn't able to get supplies in. Well, when government agents are hunting you down, sometimes shopping trips need to be cut short. We'll survive. We always have. If needs be, we can eat you. You're the fast. <laughs> I sent Lenny and Bill hunting, and they found nothing. Well, Lenny's more into book learning than hunting. Bill's a fool. Unless those mountains are full of game that want to read, ain't no wonder they found enough nothing. of this. We'll go find something. Come on, Arthur. Wait a second. Hold on. Here. 
You're gonna need something neat out there. Assorted salted awful. <laughs> Starving will be preferable. Come on, let's go. You can't go hunting. Look at your hand. I can't stay here listening to you two. True. Give this game in those hills, I'll find it. And you can kill it. You need to rest, Charles. You think this is rest? Come along. I don't mind doing my hunting with Charles. Here, you take this. Find I can't use it. You'll have to. Oh, you're joking. Use a gun, and we'll scare off every animal for miles around. You're never too old to learn, I imagine. Come on, this way. Oh boy. So I hope the graphics are getting a bit, a bit better. Because if we need to hunt and we can't see shit. How are you holding up, Charles? I'm okay. Apart from this hand. Stupid mistake. Still bad? It'll be fine in a day or two. I just can't pull a bow right now. Uh, sure hope I can. Never really got the hang of it. You'll be fine. <sighs> so, you reckon we're gonna find something to kill that ain't no Driscoll? Huh. There's meat up here for sure. Pearson doesn't know what he's talking about. Now the weather's eased off a bit, they'll be needing to feed. Yeah, but we we'll can't see way. much. Find some higher ground. Oh, well, we need to trust Ooh. Charles. Been a wild few days, all right. That ride north from Blackwater, getting stuck in the storm, bringing John back in. You've had a lot put on you. I wish I could have done more. I didn't mean it like that, just a lot to think back on. I still don't really know what happened on that boat. Me need a... What? Well, Javier told me a bit, but it sure weren't good. I still control the horse, yeah. That's true. It is so, so bright. At least we don't have long to do in Kota. And next episode, I swear, I'll try to uh, make it look better. I feel it comes from the output from the console, but I'm not too sure. I have to try some stuff. So we're going thin down to like. See some of the ground of uncovered here. Let's look down this way. Nice walk. Mm. The wind's Boy. died down too. That's good. No wind at all is bad, but if it's too strong, they won't move. Now shh. Stay quiet. Good one, boy. Stay quiet, Archer. I hope we'll be able to see those deer with Hey, stop here snow. a second. I see something. Hold! <clears throat> what do you see, Charles? Trots. There's deer been here. Recently. How can you tell? How can you not? Let's walk it from here. All right. You're gonna need the bow. Don't leave it on your horse. A gun will scare everything around. Horse whip and wheel. Let's grab the bow. Quiet as you can. Stay low and move slowly. Hunt for the deer. Can we go into the line? You see the tracks? I think so. Maybe not. Focus. Okay, now we can. Oh, at least in the light, we can see a bit better. It's easier in the snow, but once you get. Yeah, go in that way. You'll be able to track nearly as well in grass and woods. I don't 
don't see any here. Oh, there's one over there, apparently. On that side of the river on the other side, or oh, this one there. Shh. Down there. You see him? Yeah. Quick, get that bow out, Arthur. Try to hit him in the neck or head. Quick and clean. Get good tension on the string before releasing. Just don't overdo it. Quick, before they move. Good shot. Now let's try for another. Let's try for another. There's another one on the other side, it seems. I tried an animal attention by selecting call while I mean I did. But the other one is on the other side of the river. That one there. Oh, dude, that's the one over there. But oh, there's two of them. Slowly. That's all we can carry. All right. Okay, you pick up one, I'll get the other. You sure your hands are okay? Uh, it'll be fine once I get it on my shoulder. Which one are you picking okay. up? Pick up. Nice hunting. Why did the compendium update? Could have got him to the wine. Come on. Oh, stamina is I'm gonna get this packed on my horse. We sell to your horse. The horse will respond to your call as long as it's in range. It is in range. Still what are you doing? Deer. Let's get out of here. Pretty good hunt there, boy. Ready to head back when you are. Come on, then. Let's head back. Yeah. Yeah. It's looking a bit better now. Nice work, Still a lot Arthur. of highlights. There should be enough meat here to keep us all fed for a few days. You found him. I knew you'd be okay with that bow. It's easier when they ain't shooting back. <laughs> We've seen enough of that. Considering how things were looking a couple of days back, well, maybe our luck is finally on the turn. Seems to me we should be putting our effort into getting off this mountain now. Yeah, true. Soon. People are still weak, and well, you've seen how snowed in those wagons are. They ain't going nowhere until we get some more thaw. Mm, you're probably right. And even if we do get off here, what then? We'll still have a big price on our heads. This is a big country. We'll find somewhere to lie low. Dutch and Jose will have a plan. Dutch always have a plan. Notice how Pearson's had a bottle in his hand ever since we fled Blackwater? We give the camp cook five minutes to grab the essentials and go, and he doesn't even bring a crumb of food. Good though we caught more than one. A lot of mouths to feed. And that girl from the ranch now, too. 
but not sure she'll be eating much. She has a wild look in her eye. You would, too. She lost her husband, her home, everything she had. Huh. So what do we do with her? Once we get out of here and we're back on our feet, we'll see. She might have family somewhere. So it was O'Driscoll's you ran into there? Yeah. <laughs> Last thing we was expecting. What is it with the O'Driscoll's? You ain't dealt with them? I suppose. Hell, we ain't run into them much the last six months. I guess because they've been over this way. Yeah. I've heard a lot of talk about them. Well, we've been scrapping over scores with them for years. Big gang. Nasty sons of bitches. Their leader, Cole, and Dutch go way back. But not in a good way. A proper blood feud. Watch out. Bear up ahead. Oh, yeah. Let's see if we can find another way around. He's got a lot of meat on him. We've got enough here. No need to push our luck. Yeah, and trust me, you he can't kill him. Real hungry. Stay well back. Spring storms like this are the worst for animals that sleep all winter. I tried to kill him so many times. You can't kill him. He can kill you though, like pretty fast when it's coming at you. You can scare him off, but you can't kill him. I think you can scare him off. And then Charles telling you you're fool for trying to do so. Yeah. All right, boy. Go easy, boy. Talk that much, you and me. How long you been with us now? Five, six months? Something like that. But you didn't expect this. What? Any of this. Blackwater mess. Being up here? Ah. Uh, sooner or later, a job's gonna go wrong. Nature of life. I just thought you might have moved on by now. You want me to move on? No. No, not at all. I just. I know you could run it alone, no problem. I did that for a long time. I'm done with it. Always wondering if someone's gonna kill you in your sleep. I still wonder that most nights. <laughs> I reckon you're okay. This suits me. Sure, I could fall in with another gang, but Dutch. You know, Dutch is different. Oh yes, Dutch is certainly different. <laughs> he treats me fair. Most of you do. And for a fellow with a black father and an Indian mother, that ain't normally the case. Well, especially not in those we days. We need you now. More than ever. Good. And how long have you been with these boys? Why ain't you run off? Me? Oh. 20 years, something like that. Since I was a boy. 20 years? Yeah. yeah. Long time. He taught me to read. John, too. He taught me a few other things, him and Hosea. Huh. I'm sure. Dutch saved me. Saved most of us. That's why we need to stick by him through this. He always sees us right. How's that new horse? How is that right. come soon? He'll do for now. I appreciate you letting me one. take time the other night. She's a strong one. It's been as hard on the horses as on the rest of us. I don't know what Dutch would do if something happened to the Count. Same with Bill and Brown Jack. He's a drunk, miserable bastard, but he loves that horse. <laughs> I hope they all make it. I tried to ride the Count once. Fuck me faster than a bull. Won't take nobody but him. The crown is a white area behind me. We'll get our own. Don't oh. be worried. We are about to encounter. Yes, those missions are a bit story heavy. 
listen to a lot of the dialogue to to know the story and know what's going on before they get into more action. I'm gonna hit time over here. Got some food back, boys. Get these over to Pearson. Oh, yeah, no. Thank you for showing me how to use the bow properly. I only showed you a little. It takes a lifetime of practice to master. So the idea are full of well, snow well, now. Well. All the details in there. And Just it's a twist down in here. What a surprise. You find a camp rat loitering around in the kitchen. Is that any way to greet an old friend? I feel like we haven't spoken for days. I do my utmost to avoid you. Ah, he loves me, really. It's his sad way of showing affection. No, it isn't. Now shoot, get lost. Uh, well, see you gents later. See, you got on just fine. Charles is a wonder. Have a drink, boys. You earned it. Jesus, what is that? Navy rum, sir. It's the only thing. The only thing. <laughs> Keeps you saying it does. Yeah, oh. seems to have done a treat on you. You go rest that hand, Charles. We'll be fine in a few days. You mind helping me with the skinning, Mr. Morgan? It's easier if we do it together. Do I get to skin you? <coughs> You're always one with the jokes, aren't you? Come on. This really isn't a job for a man with a burnt hand. I'll see you both later. You skin that one, did you dumped on the floor there. The perfect day, you mean? We do first cleaning of the day. We're gonna have to do a lot of this. Huh. Not too bad, Mr. Morgan. Yeah. They always said you were a butcher. You know, you could trade these or sell these in pretty much any town if you're looking to make a legitimate bit of money, of course. Right now, I'm just looking to get off this mountain alive. Well, if you catch anything else, you bring it to me. Sure. <laughs> Thank you, Mr. Morgan. Heck, Arthur Morgan's first decent bit of hunting after all these years. Yeah, well, we're on the run now. Everyone's got to do their bit to survive. Just make a good stew. Folk need it. It's been a tough few days. <sighs> Here we are, Master Hunter number one, one of 3 this team. That's a good start. Master Hunter challenge. And we completed the compendium, but maybe not completed. I don't remember what we need. It's chain. Oh, we need to study it too. Cool, 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 cool. Let's go back. So that's going to be it for today, for first episode in chapter one. Oh, mission complete. Gold. What were the objective on this one? HD with one arrow we did in the spot Did a clean kill on the second one. Jeez. Two rolled already. Pretty nice. So, yeah, we're going to leave it there for today. Uh, next episode, we'll finish chapter one. I think we have a couple of missions to go. And then we can be off the mountain and start free roam in chapter two. So excited for that playthrough. Thank you, everyone, for tuning in. And I'll see you in next episode. See ya.